It all started when I changed jobs. My salary shrank significantly, but my spending habits remained the same. I sank deeper into debt, and it was all my fault. I felt horrible. Before changing jobs, I had given 10% of my gross income as tithe, 10% of offerings, and 10% for charity. Now, I was only returning tithe, and it would take at least four years for me to become debt-free. But I didn't want to wait that long. I thought about Malachi 3. God challenges us to test them with our tithes and offerings. I took a very deep breath, made the decision to give 10% of my gross income as a missionary offering in addition to the tithe. The truth is, I was hoping to find some freelance work so I could make up for the offering money. But you know what happened? No extra work showed up. But you know what also happened? 10 months after I started giving the offerings, I was debt free. Don't ask me how. I guess it's God's math. He never gave extra money, but he made my life cheaper. There was this one time when I had to buy an airline ticket to go visit my ill father, and the round trip ticket cost me only $110, $140 less than the usual. After that, a friend volunteered to drive me to the airport, sparing me the cost of an Uber ride. Then some friends asked me to stay in their spare bedroom, rent free. Can you see how God's math works? The list goes on and on. As you return your tithe and give your promise, challenge the Lord, test Him, and be a witness of how transforming and joyful it is to depend entirely on Him. May we put our desires last and God first.